have uh, records of different projects, you know, change, we call it change project that, that um, the students initiate across different schools. You have some schools that, um, um, as you mentioned, they did road bombs, some other schools did um, this zebra crossing, some other schools um, uh, designed and signposts labeling for their school. So we don't suggest what they will do. We say identify the project uh, they want to do by yourself, based on the need of your own school or your immediate community. Basically, the idea is to help them to begin to see themselves as leaders, as change makers. Guys, so give yourselves a round of applause. We can't achieve as much success without the mentors who have been trained to work directly, you know, with the, with the students. From our selection process, we want to ensure that those mentors are resident very close to the schools where they are doing the mentorship. You know, sometimes the cost might just be 15 naira to and fro, and you know, so it's they don't really feel the pinch. But currently, all of that has tripled, not even doubled. So, uh, the, the the pinch is also being felt at the grassroots level. Yeah. I'm actually mentoring a group of 30 students at Government Technical College, Main Avenue, Calabar. It's been an amazing journey, you know, having to come here every Wednesday to mentor these young students that we are grooming and empowering them to become young leaders in the future. This program as, as, a, as a mentor has been so helpful to me also because most of the topics that are inside the manual are things, of course, before now, I'm not aware of. But through this program, I've been able to learn also as a mentor. My experience as a mentor has been surreal. I have never imagined that I was going to be this valuable. It's like I've been reliving my childhood in the children, literally watching them. You know, we, some of us stumbled, literally stumbled into adulthood. And the question has always been, how did I get here? We had nobody holding our hands. We had nobody, uh, you know, showing us the way. Nobody shining the light on us and telling us this is the path, what you need. We literally had to make our own mistakes and we had to learn from the mistakes. So for me, being on this platform is like laying down my life as a manual. Life didn't come with a manual, so we have a duty to ensure that the road we walked, our children do not walk it. We have to live a better society for the children, and that's why I'm here. I've learned quite a lot from this The Bridge Foundation. It has taught me how to be a leader and how to groom myself. I want to really appreciate The Bridge Foundation for their passion to see us how we can raise leaders who will transform our societies from the shambles it has found itself. Because I, as a mentee of this wonderful organization, I have been in a lot of the time. I have been able to develop some certain skills I did not know, and it was it have able to put me on a track of leadership. The Bridge Foundation have really helped me in so many ways. First of all, to improve my confidence, and also to Axe Foundation. I just want to say a big thank you to them, because without them, um, as partners, the Bridge Foundation would not have achieved her goal. Ever since uh, joining the Bridge, there had been a lot of development on him. What he learned from the bridge, he transferred it into his studies in the secondary school and his performances, they are there to speak for him. Basically, I got into the mentoring program 2020. Uh, the bridge came to my school and we had an, a session there. They taught me so much. There I learned self-esteem, self-relevance. I learned knowing yourself. I learned a whole lot. I have improved my ability to speak and address the public and also academically I put in much more effort so I can become better. I would like to say to the Bridge Leadership Foundation and Act Foundation, I, I don't think there's any way I can ever repay you because I must say this, the whole package and everything you've done has really blessed my life. The funding from Act Foundation actually means a lot to us. This foundation has been applying right from when um, Act Foundation started um, the Grand Circle. Yes, and um, the first successful one for us was the 2022 Grand Circle. When um, we got the, the news in 2022 that we've been selected, um, it was it was um, there was so much joy. We were so very happy, and you could tell immediately the kind of um, energy it it. Um, you know, but into the entire thing. You know, that motivation is there. And that's what we're saying, right? So when, when there is um, funding for projects, um, there's the motivation, right? So um, Art Foundation um, is giving us that kind of um, motivation that we need.